Bobby. Bobby. Stupid! Yes, sir. Oh, crazy! Y'all didn't want me to do it, right? <laughs> Pulling up and then motherfucker turned up, yeah, young nigga. We ain't playing that fuck, 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 fuck. Nah, nigga, nah, nigga, nah, nigga, nah, nigga, nah, nigga. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fuck it, you yeah, man, fuck I did, yeah. Fuck, fuck it, you doing? Pulling up and then motherfucker turned up, yeah, young nigga. We ain't playing that fuck, 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 fuck. Nah, nigga, nah, nigga, nah, nigga, nah, nigga, nah, nigga. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fuck it, you doing? Fuck it, you doing? Fuck it, you doing? Yeah. Fuck, fuck it, you doing? What a bad bitches. Fuck are you doing? Huh? We can cash, nigga. Fuck are you doing? Running up in your shit, nigga. Fuck are you doing? You mad about a stacking bitch, nigga? I don't give a fuck. I'm about my cash, nigga. I'm about my motherfucking paper. I'm on your ass, nigga. Hot fried over the fucking scene, nigga. Goddamn, I like them jelly beans, nigga. We in the pot, man. Swimming. Auntie up there. Cooking, hey, auntie, got them hot wings with the lemon pepper sprinkles on it. Motherfucker, put that ranch in it, nigga. Pulling up in that motherfucker, turn the gas, young yeah, nigga. We ain't playing gang. Nah, nigga, nah, nigga, nah, nigga, nah, nigga, nah, nigga, nah, nigga. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fuck is you doing? Fuck is you doing? And we got one of the real, we got a real nigga on this motherfucker too, man. Fuck you doing? Fuck you doing? Nah, nigga, nah, nigga, nah. nah. Fuck you doing? Die, nigga, die, nigga, die. die. If you wanna be stupid, I'm a strong and a star in the sky. My life is a movie, but I'm a freak though. Last night I rocked up watching Lizzo. My wig, 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 wig. Don't freak. These are real when I'm smoking with my nigga. Like this, it's like. Steppers in Louisiana. Steppers. Steppers. Everybody looking, nigga. With the fine ratchet what is that? Right oh, no, no, not big dog, nothing. Gonna give me some good pussy, nigga. Oh, oh. I ain't worried about no pussy, nigga. Fuck a pussy, nigga. Pulling up and then motherfucker turned up, yeah, nigga. I'm just not performing that. Fuck, 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 That's how you gotta do it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fuck is you doing? Fuck is you doing? Fuck is you doing? Fuck is they doing? Pulling up and then motherfucker turned up, yeah, nigga. Hey, that's her. Yo, man, you know that was a crazy performance. Listen, man, for everybody out there, listen. Go to what, what's the booking information? Go ahead and book him. Come to your club. Yeah. He do listen. He do strip clubs. He do bar mitzvahs. He do uh uh what with some weddings. I, anything. Any anything. Club. Block Chinese parties. Club. Japanese club. <laughs> Any club matter. you got. Bars. Speakeasies. <laughs> Magic uh, clubs. I base, don't care listen, what it is. Basement parties. Whatever you got going on. <laughs> we he in coming there. to do that shit. But listen, right now you're now tuned into <laughs> me 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 million dollars worth of game. Yes sir. Yes sir. Yes sir. Yes, sir. Now listen, it's going down, man. We got the ATL in the house. Desi. Banks, man, We're listen, here. man. He out here. He young. Yes, he sir. getting at it. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. I'm talking about he getting at it right now. You know, you see him. You know, Mike Epps tour. Yes, you sir. know what I mean. But he got a lot of shit going on, man. Sure do. He got a lot of stuff going a whole on. A lot man. of stuff. I'm, man. I'm saying, did you ever think you would get here this 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 quick? I ain't even gonna say it was this quick, man. I've been doing this for ten years on social media. But no, when I say this quick, because it seemed like you know, it's like for people once you get to social, you just took off quick. Like you, you jump, your numbers jump crazy. No, it, it jumped crazy. But like I said, I've been doing it for ten years on okay. media. Like I to be honest, like probably my last three years is when things really yeah. started to take off for me. I wasn't one of them guys. A lot of people did come on and the shit just went crazy. But I was one of the guys that really like came from like divine era. You know what I'm saying? Like, my shit now really started to pick up right now. So, you know what I'm saying? And I'm still elevating. I'm still not where I want to be at, and we're going to keep going up. We're going to keep going crazy. But but you remember, I remember me and you had a talk. Yes, Because one, one thing I know is about you. You on tour with Mike Epps. You're doing your thing. Yes, sir. But you never stop with the content. Can't. Never. You, you, you keep, you know, in the time frame that you, like, the last three years, I done seen so many people come and go. But I see it seem like once the shine hit, that light could, motherfucking light turn on top of them. They like, oh, I could chill now. Nah. Why you chill, bro? Why, why, why your chill button broke? Because of the people, man. The people love you, man. That's the ones that support you and putting the money in your pocket if it's about the money. But it ain't about the money for me. You know, I love doing what I'm doing because I was doing it for free, you know what I'm saying, in the beginning because, you know, I liked it. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people, you know, go for it because, you know, the fame and the money and, you know, things like that. But I got a whole other vision when it comes to it. You know what I'm saying? I, I feel like I was born to do this. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I feel like God put it in my way and shit. I'm a hustler. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm going to keep staying consistent, keeping it out there. You know what I'm saying? So, hey, I'm hungry for it. You know what I'm saying? I ain't one of the ones that's on social media that's just doing it because they seen somebody else doing it. I'm doing it because I was really born to do it. You know what I'm saying? That's why a lot of motherfuckers yeah. win, though. A yeah. lot of times you win when you do what you love. Yeah. You got to do you. And yeah. not what, what, what you think. Yeah. 
motherfuckers want to see you do. You know what I'm saying? Because LeBron James ain't playing basketball because he because of the money. He playing right. basketball because he love that shit. Exactly. Yo, stop with that dumb ass oh, shit. Oh, he's seeing another nigga I'm doing thirsty, it. Nigga. A lot of yeah. people do it because they see another person doing it. And they no, think, but, but you know. a lot of motherfuckers that don't be in their cards, though. Yeah. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah. A lot of motherfuckers is, is seeing motherfuckers do shit at... 35 and 38 and you never was funny bro <laughs> facts like you wasn't never funny your whole fucking life nah, like you was you was Canada dry your whole motherfucking life nah, my nigga facts. now you just fucking I'm just, yeah. he doing it let me give it a shot my nigga you're corny yeah there's a lot of corner people on now you, you feel know? what I'm saying or they trying to be like so, another person and right. try to you know yeah. peep game from another person but you know if it ain't you it ain't nah, you nah it ain't right. you man I mean and salute know? to the some, some motherfuckers and I'm not saying if you older or whatever, you want to get into comedy, you it can't pop off for you. Some motherfuckers, they do be funny their whole life, but they be funny behind closed doors. Nah, fact. As soon as the cameras come on, they don't be willing to put they that funny up. out there. Nah, big you feel me? So now you might get to 30 years old at 31, 32, and you might be like, fuck it. Let yeah. me, fuck it. Let me just try to give it a shot before I die. But you was actually funny, though. Nah, for sure. You, it's you, in you, me. you actually, motherfuckers, you know what I'm saying? That person, you was actually funny. You actually could make motherfuckers laugh behind closed doors. So when the lights is on, it's possible you can make motherfuckers laugh. A okay. lot of motherfuckers just be tr grabbing a surfboard and try to ride niggas' waves, That's man. It. You yeah. did this shit because you loved it. Big facts. That's the point I'm trying Big to facts. get across. Big he facts. love this shit. Yes, sir. When you love that shit, then you dedicate it to some shit you love. Most definitely. And then when you dedicated to some shit you love, you work hard, and then the money come. Most definitely. Wallow came home. He was weirdo two six seven. Let's keep it real. <laughs> he wasn't Wallow two six seven. He was fucking weirdo I two six it. seven. Motherfuckers in my family was calling me. Uh, Cause tripping. That nigga, you think he? You think he went crazy in the joint? Huh? That nigga just was laying on the ground with ketchup on his head. You think mm -hmm. he? So no. two six seven. What is two six seven? It's like your prison number or something. Yeah, that was my prison number was DG two six seven zero. But it's also the area code of Philly. Okay. But when I went to really? prison, it wasn't the area code yet. Mm. But that was my number, way before then. Oh, that's that's crazy. So I put that on the end of my name two six seven. Nah, fact. And that's how that shit come. Nah, big fact. Now, when you was young, who did? What comedians you looked at and had you dying? Like who did you? Who Eddie, who, who was the ones you looked at? My favorite was Eddie Murphy. You know, if you look at stuff that I do right now, as far as like character work, everything I do, I base my stuff on him. I feel like he's my biggest inspiration when it cool. comes to stuff. And you know, I, I'm doing some of the stuff that he did, like creating short films. You know, with my characters, um, sketches and things. You got a like short that. film out now, on yeah, the, called, on YouTube. Uh, yeah, where, where they, where, tell them, tell, tell them about. Yeah, that man, it's on YouTube right now, going crazy. Me, um, Banks Family Christmas. Um, when I first put it out, man, it hit number two trending on YouTube, man, which was crazy. Independently shot and produced, you know. From myself, from my pockets, man. Shout out to my team. They here. And, you know, it was crazy. We had some adversity, but we still got it done for the people. We did it for Christmas. We, we shot the thing in two days. In two days, man. Put it out. It's at probably about 1.6 million views right now. Going crazy. But that's just on us. And just me believing in ourselves and not waiting on opportunities. A lot of motherfuckers wait to tell a motherfucker, like, yeah, I, I'm waiting until I get this audition or I book this, you know, such and such. But now, I ain't doing that. I want to build my own. I got my own production company. You know what I'm saying? I, I'm shooting my own sketches. You know, I'm, I'm I'm trying to take them to a whole nother level. You know what I'm saying? I'm one of, like I said, I'm one of them guys that 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 really trying to do it on social media. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I ain't just no nigga that just doing it, like I said, doing it just because everybody well, trying to do the shit. Well, yeah. look, I'm, let me put this out there. You not trying to do it on social media because you in Philadelphia right now on tour. On tour. With the big dog, with some OGs that I watched growing up. Right. You so know what I'm so so you what you're doing is working. Nah, big You fact. ain't trying to do shit. Yes, sir. <laughs> you yeah. feel what I'm saying? Yeah. What you're doing is working because it's not like you're going to come out tonight at the biggest arena in Philadelphia and they're going to say, give it up. Who does And they're going to be like, who the fuck is that? <laughs> yeah. Uh, with, with who that is? No, they gonna be yeah. like, ah, yeah, and you gonna come out with the dumb ass shit and, <laughs> and go right in. It go nah, right sure. in. You nah, feel what sure. I'm saying? So, sure. so, bro, you made it work. Yes, you know sir. what I'm saying? And the reason why I reached out to you when I found out that you was in the city is because it's a lot of youngins. Because see, one thing about me and I was worth a game, bro. We represent the youth, man. Yeah. yeah. I'm going to say this again, man. If we get an old nigga on here, it's because he's a legend. Yeah. And because he got game to yeah. get a youth. Yeah. And because we really feel like he fuck with the youth. Right. 
We don't give a fuck about no old niggas. I'm just being yeah, a yeah, 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 yeah. bitch. Nah, facts. You know, they, they so, t- it's time for a new generation. So shit. We up and coming. We embrace motherfuckers that own tomorrow. Yeah. Like you said, this shit wasn't easy. I worked for this shit. Yeah, no, it wasn't. I, I was doing this shit seven years before I really even started getting some true light. Facts. I was doing a million dollars worth of games yeah. since 2012. Yeah. Before this shit turned into a podcast in 2019. For sure. So I understand the hustle. Yeah. And we wanted to put some light on you yeah. to show all these youngins out here all yeah. across the world. Yeah. The next Desi Banks, the next 85 South, yeah. the next Just, Just Hilarious, mm-hmm. the, the next Ha Ha Davis, mm-hmm. the next all the motherfuckers that made it. Mm-hmm. Made you made me motherfucking Instagram and social media into a funnel. Most definitely. To feed fans. That's a way for getting, sure. Get noticed and make some money. Yeah. So that's why we want you to come on here and we want to, you know, you to be visual proof. No, I'm gonna definitely, man. To yeah. all the comedians out here that you could do this shit, man. Yeah. From your household. From your f- cell phone. Forget your head. You know what I'm saying? That cell phone, like you say, that cell phone changed my life. You changed know your life, saying? huh? Found my real purpose into what I'm doing right now. I'm touching way more people. I play football, you know what I'm saying? But right now, I'm touching way more people that I would, you know. I played football for Penn State, I would have his ass up, too. No, he would not. Yes, I, I was, seen bro. your crippled legs, bro. No, bro that, that's not it. And I don't know I who taught you that. I learned that from Deion Sanders. Bro, that's yeah. a jam type of DB, man. No, that your work. knees got to go in a that's little bit. That's not it, bro. Yeah, you going to get crippled. For him. When any, you got a quick receiver, he going to go crazy on you. Let me just tell you this. Any <laughs> cornerback. <laughs> Jalen Ramsey, yeah, crazy legs, crazy legs. Crazy legs. Yeah, no, that's yeah, what they that's called you in the joint. Man, fuck you, fuck talking about crazy legs. Crazy legs. Fucking crazy legs. Fuck out of here, man. You trying to fill me your joint? You crazy legs. Fuck, you, fuck you, you with CLW. You was on joint. your knees. You went on your knees. <laughs> like that. Fuck out of here. You ain't shit uh, I played for Penn State though. Really? No. Man, stop it. No, he was no. no I'm gonna get right. No, he played for this. He played in the state pen. He was the he was a first team all state. Center the way he hiked the, the balls. Oh, they yeah. love the way they was. Well, he loved it. Ass and air. Come on, man. damn. Oh. He lying. He lying. <laughs> that shit is crazy, man. I, I would never days. expect that, man. Hold up. Yes, allow, you would. Allow us to go. He lied like a he, he lying. <laughs> but on that note, allow us to go to our sponsors. Right. This episode of Million Dollars Worth of Game is brought to you by New Amsterdam Vodka. Now, um, life ain't going your way. Shot in New Amsterdam Vodka. Mm-hmm. Caught your bitch sucking somebody's dick today. Shout out to New Amsterdam Vodka. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You thought your check was coming in the mail and that bitch didn't come your way. Shout out to New Amsterdam Vodka. <laughs> I mean, it's distilled five times. It's filtered three times. That's uno, dos, tres, if you're, you know, Hispanic. You know, when it's filtered, you know, with a clean, crisp finish, Smooth, so you can drink it on the rocks. You can drink it straight up. You can drink it with juice, apple, orange, pineapple. Yes. Or you can make a classic New Amsterdam meal. It's up to you. It's great for pregame too. Playoffs, you know, oh, yeah. basketball. I mean, what are we talking about? So when you're out and about at your local liquor store, make sure you pick up some New Amsterdam vodka, the official vodka of Barstool Sports. And shout out to y'all. Know I got a shout out to New Amsterdam Queen. Be at the crib. Judy. You know, doing it up with the girls. Making cocktails with the New Amsterdam. Shout out to you, baby. I'll be on later on tonight to lay you down and spray you down. Yeah. So they drink, it gets you like that. Yeah, it gets you tore up from the flow up. You know what I mean? But it's smooth though. You know what I mean? So you can't drink too much because we don't, you know, we don't support drinking and driving. Gotcha. You know, so when you make sure you at the crib when you, you know what I mean? Drink responsibly. Right, right drink responsibly. Cool, cool, cool. So you on tour, man. Yeah. How many cities y'all got? With Mike yeah. or with, with myself? Well, uh, I got about six cities with him right now um, for this year. But I did a whole October run with him um, last year. We did probably about about eight cities. Mm-hmm. Went crazy, you know. Um, one of the young guns on there um, right now, and I'm like with this one right now. I'm one of the. I'm really the youngest one right now, you know, as well. So you know, with that being told, you know, that just allowed me to just own, you know, who I am and just build me up, man, and just let the world know, like, shit, we up next. You know what I'm saying? What's your stronger advice? You know, that game that uh, Mike then gave you since you met him. Shit, be yourself. You know what I'm saying? Don't change for nobody, you know what I'm saying? And know that, you know, you you can win with yourself. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people, you know, they get into this Hollywood world and feel like, you know, they got to change for these people. But shit, I already done built, you know, what I got already. You got your own yeah, empire. You, you know got your saying? own so people. I'm, I'm already coming with something. You know what I'm saying? I ain't coming that, you know, I need y'all to help me, like, get some people. And I already got it. I already built it. You know what I'm saying? I already got my... Fans that that love me, you know everything I touch, everything I do, they support it. 
You know what I'm saying? So I'm thankful that I'm in that place where shit, I could just do what I want to do. And it, it's authentic. It's me. I ain't got to change for nobody. Let me ask you this question. Yeah. At what point was you out and about you with somewhere and a motherfucker walked up on you and was like, yo, that's it, nigga. I fuck with you, nigga. You did. And it just fucked you up. You was like, nigga, that's in your mind. You know, you might ain't sure you was fucked, but in your mind, you was like, yo, that's a uh, such and such. I ain't even. Oh, gonna... shit. Nah, fact. Like, are you saying like a. Uh... Uh, a celebrity or right, just a, like oh, you know, you on your way up, you coming up, you doing your thing, you bump into a celebrity, somebody you know, somebody you fuck with, somebody you know, and they like, yo, man, I fuck with you, and you in your yo, mind, yo, you know what's crazy? That shit happened to me. I seen somebody, I, I was starstruck. Who? When you was at the game, you left. You ain't gonna believe who came. Who? Oh. Fucking Lil, Lil Wayne. Oh yeah, he turned really? into a fucking wheezy groupie. Listen, yes, he listen, fucking came, right? did. No bullshit. That nigga started saying every oh, wheezy song. Oh my god! I said fuck Gilly. Hey, listen, listen, that nigga, listen, all that shit. So listen, listen, Wayne walked in there. This, this nigga happened. gonna scream out. Oh, wobbly, 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 drop it like it's Fire man, like, come in. I was like, I was like, out of like, like, all the lies hey, Dez, you can say, you so scream listen. out, drop it like it's hot. So listen, that listen, nigga wanted to go. You wanted to go dreads at the time. This nigga see Wade and hollered out. Oh, wobbly, 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 drop it like it's hot. Bling bling. I went crazy. I oh, didn't. yeah. So listen, I see, I said, like, so the nigga like this tall, I'm like, damn, man. I'm like, that's Wayne. Fuck everything that was going on, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, I'm there did. with I'm talking to Dion. Dion Wayne walking, everything stopped. Yeah, yeah. But I, he act like he ain't, ain't know me no more. Turned he went straight in the groupie mode. No GM. bullshit. I was, I was a hype man. Fuck the DM. He was in the GM. I was a hype man. Groupie right? so mode. Listen, I stopped going hype man mode. Like damn. He was like easy. Wayne. Do you need a professional dick hoster on <laughs> no, tour? No, Gil, Gil talking about something. Do you need somebody to just hey, listen, hold your Dad. dick on tour for <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> you know, until you're ready to pull it out and have sex? Yo, this nigga is crazy. This nigga right here. I shouldn't have called this nigga. He told me, what's up, cuz? Nothing, nigga. I'm Wayne right here. <laughs> Fuck you. I'm, try, I'm trying to listen. My whole thing is, I'm like, damn. I'm trying to get a picture, picture with Wayne yeah. and just, you know, the best little rapper alive shit. Facts. You know what I mean? And I'm a hot boy now. Some shit like that. You oh, know yeah. how niggas be lying in the caption yeah, yeah, when yeah, they yeah. take pictures with rappers. Mm -hmm. Man, I look up. Him and Gil, him and Gil see each other. Wayne, what's they on some? Yo. Yeah. What's up, baby? Yeah. I'm like, damn. I'm not with that nigga, Wayne. I don't, whatever's going, I, you know, whatever happened. I know they cool. Yeah, yeah. But I'm like, Fuck that nigga. I'm trying to get my picture because you holding the shit up. Yeah. So next thing I look up, the nigga was gone. Wayne gone. Nigga disappeared, man. Shit was like a dream. I was like, it was like, it was like a dream, <laughs> man. He blamed it on me. Wayne well, see you in love. <laughs> Yeah, I was like, you fucking let us hate no bitch. I was like, I was like, damn, I was, I was like, we, you know, we will call his management, see if he need a dick no, hoster no, no, for no, the next tour. Like, it was some real shit because I'm like, damn, man, this, this is the best rapper alive. No, nah, like, the best. Bro. I ain't gonna cap. I'll probably be like that if I see I'm like, talking about you left. As soon as the game was over, we was in the back. He yeah. came through. Oh, no, I got a thing. Damn. That yeah, he came, came through. right through. Like, yes, shit. he did. Yep, and he, he fell in love. That motherfucker like this tall. I'm like, damn, we... Why you keep talking about how tall he is? Man? No, so, like, was, look at him. Look, what, what type of nigga just no, keep saying that? that nigga, nigga, I'm just that saying. Nigga what type of nigga just keep saying that? No, because that nigga like this tall. Like, are right, you no, said that saying, once. Man. It's four times later. No, he, it's like... because. Fuck you was sizing him I, up to kiss him. So and like, then I'm saying to myself, you know, I've been over like hey, this. Hey, some real shit. Like, I'm saying to fuck myself, you like, talk about, like, I don't know when I'm going to catch up with this nigga again. Nah, you ain't get no picture, no phone number. Fuck no, because uh, this nigga. But, why, but let me ask you, because why you want to catch up with him so bad? Like, no, because that's some shit I got to ask him. But, 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 but what's going on is that motherfucker going to lie to you anyway. Yeah, come on, man. Get with me. How am I going to get with you? Exactly. You know that Hollywood But I talk. wouldn't say that, so I could be like, yeah, Wayne told me to get when he want to catch you. Oh, yeah, yeah, get yeah, the picture. yeah, yeah. Yeah, Wayne, it was, the vibe was real. Yeah. But act like we kicked it up. Yeah, we had some big, it, talked about some big things. No, no, big things coming. That's that's the caption. Oh, yeah. Big things coming. Well, that, that shocked the world right there, even though it ain't shit. But people don't know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Nobody know. I done lied plenty of times. <laughs> Who did you lie with when you took a picture with? I told niggas, I got movies coming with these niggas in there. <laughs> they like nigga, what a movie at? Shit, it got canceled. <laughs> <laughs> COVID. But 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 you see how hype they be. Listen, 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 listen. You see how hype they be, because I just see niggas page. I knew they was capping. And everybody be in the in the cap. I'm so proud of you. Yeah, it's your yeah. turn. I knew this was gonna happen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah. got motherfuckers hyped up, you know shit ain't happening. Yeah, that's a fact. It's a good look sometimes though. <laughs> you know, it opens opens open some doors. You know, until they start asking questions. Yo, mm -hmm. during, during your journey, how much cabin was involved? Oh, for with me or people? You. Uh, a few. <laughs> Fake it till you make it. God damn it. Shit. No. Lie. Whoever yeah. made that line to that ass yeah. nigga make it to you. Yeah. I can't wait to laugh on this podcast. Yeah. It's like when to get the picture with y'all. Yeah. Like, yeah, I'm, I'm a new member of the um, yeah, group. Yeah, <laughs> That's nice. That's what you got hit him with. Yeah, I'm a third point. We 
We did some big deals. New year. <laughs> yeah. New year, new plans, new goals, all that big shit. Mm-hmm. For sure. You yeah. know what I mean? Tell them I got me new a spot. New bank account. In, new bank account. Got me a spot in Philly now. All that shit. Yeah, yeah. I'm in Philly. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Finna change the W to DW, Desi and Wallow. Uh-huh. <laughs> DWG, yeah. Desi Wallow Gill, Dude, yeah. the podcast. Come on, man. The podcast. Productions. Look at that. Uh-huh. Yeah. Nigga, she was moving. She was moving in two days. But I'm telling me, like, what type of crew you had? Big crew, small, crew, regular? Crew? Well, that crew right there was a that was a, that was one of my biggest uh, crews that I had. Man, I had you paid for this out of pocket? Yeah, out of pocket. Yeah. How much you paid for it? If you mind, uh, two days I paid about almost fifty thousand. Damn, you made that back already? Yeah, you know, in like two days. You gonna make? You made that shit back already? Yeah. You know, but I wanted to do it, and I wanted to do it for the people. I wouldn't even worry about the money. Because yeah. then I'm like, we almost didn't do this shit. I'm going to tell you the story. Like, we were shooting this shit at the Airbnb. You're not supposed to shoot no films in no Airbnb. No. Yeah. You're not supposed to do that. You to let you know, you got to let the people know, like, hey, we shooting a film, whatnot. So yeah. the first day we were shooting that shit, you know what I'm saying? We was almost, like, the scenes that I could have got, that I, I could have been good to shoot it somewhere else, I, I could have got it done. The dude come in, I'm talking about this nigga's a, like a Mexican. Like, he don't even speak English. You know what I'm saying? So he come in, being on the door. Do, 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 do. Hey, you guys gotta get out. You, you, you get, 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 get out. Do, do. He, I'm like, yo, like, shit. Like, they just let us do this. It's like, hell no. Y'all should never did this. You know what I'm saying? Y'all should have told us. What the So I'm like, man, fuck. I done paid these people to shoot this shit. And I can't get the money back because, you know, they, that's their time. You know what I'm saying? So I had to figure some shit out. You know what I'm saying? Everybody in there arguing. I'm in there arguing with this nigga. I'm finna fight this nigga. I'm like, nigga, you should have fucking told me. Nigga, it, you know, yeah. I'm finna kill every fucking body. You know, I ain't, I ain't even no killer, but at the time, <laughs> you was a killer. I was a killer. You was a, you was I a was real, a real savage, you, man. I'm telling us, you, nigga, you I had nigga. Hey, nigga. He done did some front like that, like he was gonna put some shit down. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, it depends. I'm trying to shoot no. anything in this motherfucker. Nah, yeah. I'm like, fact, no, nigga, because sometimes if you holler and you got a little aggression, you could bluff some niggas that probably got some real nah, sticks on them. You can scare some niggas for sure. Yeah, and that's the whole thing about being a lot of niggas get mad and they eyes get red. But some of the most scaring a lot of niggas right now in my. Life is no bullshit. They be like that nigga eyes is red. This is you about need to like, leave that nigga alone. This is about like sixty seven <laughs> niggas. Listen, there's no bullshit, man. It's about like sixty seven niggas on Instagram, like gangster tough niggas that I'm scared of, and I know they bitch ass niggas. But it's just about. <laughs> no, I'm just saying. It's a lot about, of niggas can't fight though, man. That's too, but I. But you can't try to find it out if a nigga can nah, fight. You could because you might get shot though. Man, look, a I nigga. think sometimes you could look at a person like I know he can't fight. Wait, he, hold on. You just said it's about 60 niggas on Instagram <laughs> that you scared of, but you know they bitch no, ass niggas. No, because like, like, how does that add up? Because I can just see it that they're not built for that, but but it, most of the time, the way they delivering their gangster shit, oh, yeah. I believe that. Oh, yeah. I know they bitch ass, but I believe, like, damn, that nigga, and it's scary, so I just <laughs> say, you know what, I'm going to leave that shit alone. Savage. You got to leave some shit alone sometimes. Yeah, yeah that gun ain't Listen, fucking around. Oh, it ain't no joke down Atlanta right now. It's, it's, it's wild, wild. It's just yeah, wild. Yeah. It ain't it, no joke down there. No, man. it ain't. The motherfuckers ain't playing. No, they ain't playing. They they ain't been playing. Man, niggas ain't playing. You just gotta be careful. Listen, you gotta be around the right people. No, let me tell you what happened. We in Atlanta. We go to the gas station, right? Which one? Uh, it wasn't too far from a uh, Buckhead somewhere. It wasn't. It was oh, like yeah. it wasn't too far from from the, from the mall. It wasn't too far oh, from Lennox. But but still, it don't matter. So we go there. We going to get our shit. He getting his blunts. And me, I'm always on point. Cause yeah. see, from from my my martial arts training and all that shit, military. I had a military background based off my old hair Earl because he was in the military and that gave me the, the training. That's some other shit. Yeah. But by me always being, I'm always security minded. So we coming out to John, he want to go get some fucking Dutchess. I tell him, get them doors in the daytime. Don't <laughs> First get, of all, backwoods. Backwoods. Oh, my fault. Smoke fucking he Dutchess. want to get some, some, some backwoods, right? <laughs> my whole thing is when I'm somewhere else, get all your shit in the daytime. Yeah. Lay up in the whole chill at nighttime. Yeah, Don't yeah, be coming yeah. up winding around and shit. He want to wind. I didn't even ask you to come with me. You, oh, I'm gonna ride with you. I don't need you to ride with me, nigga. No, because because if I don't go, I was I was waiting for him. I wasn't didn't want to go because if anything happened, I, I wasn't there. I, I ain't got no. I, he can't say I ran and all that. So yeah, yeah. I go down there, man. We coming out the joint. I'm like, oh shit, cuz don't even look. Yeah, it's going down. They coming. <laughs> These niggas get out the car right there. Just listen, the guns hanging out, all type of shit. I'm like, yeah, the stand the guns right on them, right? It's on with the with with the ladder in them, the what? ladder hanging out, Ooh. showing. All, I'm like they coming. They, they for all come yeah. down. I say, kill him. Well, he's scared to death. Yo, like, yeah. Hey, think I cool. didn't know you they just like, had a gun like that. Can we get a picture, nigga? 
Yeah, boy, like, they, fuck is you talking about like he, I'm like these niggas we want a picture like, like chill so, out so, over so here I said he's a nut ass nigga yeah he bitch it. you was bitches though I was I'm saying y'all got no, your no, gun no, no, taken I was, out I was but I turned into a real no it ain't about nothing man you know I do that shit too yeah you know what I mean you gotta you gotta, you gotta, <laughs> no, you gotta do they gotta I mean, know you but I, you you went to prison for 20 years yeah so but that shit don't mean nothing though it's different you still could be a bitch ass nigga at the prison like it's 20 years Bitch ass nigga at the prison. We gonna do a story about that because that's bitch ass nigga. Yeah, you you know what I mean. I'm I'm like, you do twenty wallow. years in prison. You got to be a tough nigga. nigga. After you don't got to be tough. Low. Anything can happen, nigga. You ain't got to be tough to come, nigga. That's how you most went to of the niggas in prison ain't tough. Bro. Fuck no. They nigga, they scared of shit. Man, listen, you know it's really. You know how many niggas in there is? They really soft as cream of wheat, but they lost their mind and operated that tool. On they chick because she threw a dick in her mouth. Mm. Yeah. And they just was operating out of emotions. Ah, no, uh, bitch, no. You suck a like dick. Boom. Yep. No, and now, now he in jail yeah, like this. He wasn't no killer. He wasn't nothing. He actually worked for the cable company. He was he set Comcast up really fucking good. I'm and, talking about he was the best Comcast nigga setting up the why you ain't see the why is enough and when he got done with your shit. But he caught his woman with a dick in his mouth in her mouth. <laughs> and now he's sitting in the penitentiary. Is And guess what she doing? There's a lot of niggas in there like that. And guess what she doing though? Oh, she's she, heaven. She still got uh, oh he killed her. I was yeah. like, she still got dicks in her mouth. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, if he don't kill her, she's yeah. still gonna have dicks Brandon in her mouth. Johnson's in the mouth. She ain't gonna care about There's a lot him. of niggas in there because the same thing they beat their woman up. Yeah. You feel what I'm saying? And they ain't no killer, but they just lost their mind. They got emotional. Emotion, yeah. emo, emotions, I have a nigga d- doing a thousand sunups and sundowns out this motherfucker, man. It's the vagina. You no, said, that shit crazy, but listen. That's one, cra- that's a powerful thing. This episode of the Million Dollars Worth of Game is brought to you by Roman Swipes. Once again, Roman always comes to you for you guys in the clutch. A lot of you guys never make it. A lot of you guys never make it off the bench. You know what I mean? The game start. You're all excited. You you all amped up. You think you ready to go in. You never get out, never get on the field. You never get on the court. You I'm talking about you never even make it. I'm talking about, listen, man. It's sad for a lot of you guys. A lot of you guys really need to get your stuff together. And cause she's upset with you because you can't perform on the next level. You keep talking about your MVP. You don't even get in the game. Roman Swipes is gonna help you with that. I'm talking about, I'm talking about fast acting. I'm talking about, listen, no prescription needed. I'm talking about. Help you stay stronger and last longer. Because obviously that's what you need because you're not doing what you need to do. So what you need to do is when you choose a monthly, I'm talking about a monthly subscription, listen, your first order is just $5. $5 when you choose a monthly subscription of Roman Swipes, man. Go to GetRoman.com slash game. What are you waiting for? You know you need to help. GetRoman.com slash game. You, you, did you have a like stalker chick? most powerful chick? thing on planet Earth. Like, did, you, did you have a stalker chick at like be, be outside why? Cause she ain't answer the phone. Did you ever do any stalker shit to a chick? I did. What happened? I, I uh, it was a time, man. Um, yeah, I, I got yeah niggas. Every nigga they heart broke. Yeah, bitch, fuck me up. Um, my not my ex, my ex ex. I pulled hey, up. I was about two exes yeah, ago. Two, huh? Yeah, two exes ago. Yeah, I pulled up like at three o'clock in the morning. Like she was lying. She was like, yeah, I'm um, I ain't at home. So, so, so. And I see a picture on um, <laughs> on Facebook. <laughs> what picture? With a nigga, a nigga. He had the the same spot. <laughs> and I'm like, I pull up. I'm like, stop lying. Like, you, you, you <laughs> did you have a gun on you? Did you have a gun on you? I did. I, I had. I, I did. I had my. You know, I'm like secure, but I, I did. Um, I had my homeboy with me too. Mm. Was he, he strapped like, too? Yeah, he was strapped yeah, too. Yeah, but he was, he was really gonna do it though. If yeah. I, you know, <laughs> <laughs> if I needed it, I wasn't gonna do it. I was gonna look like I was gonna do yeah. it, but he was gonna actually pop yeah. him. Hey, <laughs> hey, hey, hey! You know what's so funny? Your man is me. <laughs> And you was him. He the type <laughs> nigga get out there, talk crazy to a nigga, and then say, shoot him, Gil, in front of everybody. Wait, yeah, yeah. wait, wait, oh, what? Yeah. Oh, just yeah. throw me the fuck yep. out there. Yeah, like, he, he, and, he, that and that nigga was like, yo, chill, I don't want to have to do nothing. Like, you know, because I'm in, I'm outside the house. I'm like, yo, bitch, come outside. Da-da-da. Oh, you screaming, your neighbors Yeah, 3 o'clock in the morning. But they're going to tell his man to put yeah, the work in. I'm mad as fuck. Like, but, her mama come outside. Like, yo, they, look, just leave. Just leave. Wait, like, no, a, that yeah, nigga name. Yeah, I'm out of there every fucking thing. Yo, what was the nigga name? Wait. You know, I don't even want to talk about the nigga because it's so fucked up. <laughs> the pussy had him fucked up. Then nigga, the pussy had me fucked up. Because I was thinking, like, man, he getting there killing her. <laughs> <laughs> he drilling her shit right now. 
That's all I, I can just think about the time uh, she gave me the head and he, I was hitting it from the back and I'm like, he doing the same shit. Hey, he woke up yeah. mama. I was hurt, man. He woke up mama. I woke the mama up. I think it was and she, I think she told the mama to go outside to come. The nigga ain't come outside. The nigga ain't well, come outside. Bro, he was going blaze the shit yeah. up. I, I, he I, was I, emotional as shit. How long shit. was you down there, man? In at, at, at a spot? Yeah, how long? I probably did like two hours. <laughs> Yeah, I won't leave until she came outside. Did she come out? What did she say when she came she out? Ain't, she ain't come out. So and then when I left, <laughs> she probably called me an hour or two ago and acting like she's asleep. Bitch, you want to sleep? <laughs> you get the fuck that. I should have shot the window, <laughs> bitch, and scared your stupid ass. <laughs> and then what you said. Yeah. Hey, hey, you know what's the, you know what's the harsh thing? <laughs> <laughs> That shit, that shit broke back memories. Yeah, I'm Yo, did getting you mad ever see now. Again? Did you ever see her again? I did, man. And when I saw her, my heart drop like a motherfucker. Let me ask you a question. Was, did you ever like take you. her back? Did you say I want my family no, back? No, I hated her. Mm. I hated oh, what her. What did she say to you? Nah, like she seen me probably like maybe like a year after that, and she, you know, she saw me doing my thing a little bit. Yeah, and I was like, mm. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Now look at me now. I'm that nigga. Why you in the mall looking jacket some shoes for your little child, motherfucker? Oh, so you, you ain't have a kid by? No, I ain't had no kid by. How oh, you know that wasn't yours? That was that a year mine. Later. It was I, a year I later. I know who it was. That, that, that's the thing. She had them cheated on the nigga that had a baby by. Pissed me off. Okay. Yeah. And, and let me take all the young niggas out. Yeah, there, man. Right? Vagina. Look. Yeah, talk about well, it. What men do for, for. Listen, man. That's why we got this. This is for pussy. This get you money. This is make you look good. So money. So I they, feel like everything we do in this world, man, is. Some pussy, slice of pussy. I think it is. Slice of pussy. Mm-hmm. It is. Yeah. And then what you do? It is. Every nigga want that, 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 that nut. And me and my homeboy were talking about this shit the other day. And it's a four second feel good. Mm. Four seconds. Man, the greatest nigga, four seconds oh. in your fucking no, no, no. life. When, when, when you oh, come, when you get there. Uh, uh, it's uh, the greatest four uh, seconds uh, in your uh, life. Uh, come on, uh, when that motherfucking machine gun uh, go. Uh, <laughs> What's, what's the craziest shit you said to a a woman a woman when, when you was taking off, huh? When you when you got there, what's the craziest shit you ever told a chick? The two craziest things. <laughs> when I was growing, like going coming up with my career. No, not no. coming up with your career, but you was, when the he's four seconds. A, oh, the four seconds. He's talking about right with you. I love this shit. That's, and what else? <laughs> this shit, man. <laughs> Did she say it was? Yeah. First of all, right, let me just tell you something. Did right. you believe her? I did. Let me tell you something, right? You know, in that moment, you're going to believe it. It feels too good because she feeling good. She probably coming with you. Yeah. He say shit like, I love you forever. You know you're going to be with me forever now. I want to marry you. you no, girl? I don't say shit like that. Yes, you do. Pussy. I say shit like, uh, you know I go to jail about this pussy. Ah. <laughs> yeah. All that shit. All that crazy. You know, I go back home about this pussy. <laughs> <laughs> nah, fat. We family, my wife. <laughs> oh, I was a young boy, some old head suck, but they got screamed out. I'm giving you some money. Bitch, put my dick in the blood, I screamed out. I'm giving you some money. Nah, fat. <laughs> but I think the, the crazy ones be the ones that don't have like no income like that, though. What you mean, no income? I think when you broke, that's the- when it like really hit you harder. What you mean? Like if you ain't got no money, that's when the pussy affects you a little different. <laughs> like mm-hmm. we, but if you, oh, you know, oh, if you had money, oh, you right, right now, that right bitch, now, we got to we got to give acknowledgement to all the uh, homeless sexuals out there, all the dudes out there fucking because they ain't got no home. They fucking because they life on the line. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? A lot of niggas be out here fucking for their life. It's cold out yeah, here. They, they need, need somewhere to stay. Yeah. They, they mom said, no, nah, nigga, you can't sleep on the couch. Yeah. You didn't decorated the basement for too long. So shout out to all them dudes out there surviving. Man, it's gonna be a cold winter, man. Right. I hope you guys make it all back to the other side. No, but no, like, no, 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 no. Don't worry about it. It's always a loser chick somewhere to take them niggas in. Nah, fact. He fucked the socks off of the little chubby bitch. He take it right in, clothed up. And it's bad chicks out here that live with homeless sexuals. Bring a nigga in a nigga. Mean, what? Nigga, nigga, what? All a nigga got to do, let me tell you something. The women be wanting a warm body in that fucking bed, too. Yeah, yeah. they lonely motherfuckers. Cold women, when you when you ever get in the bed and just sleep on one side. It's cold in the motherfucker on side. roll the fuck over to the other side. Yeah. Oh, let me yeah. get back over yeah. here. Fuck yeah. is going on. They want a warm fucking body in that bed, too. Yeah. Mm-hmm. They like to play fucking footsies. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You hear yeah. me? Yeah. Yeah. Right. So don't worry. They be willing to accept them. The, come on. I know you ain't got nowhere to stay. Uh, nobody believe in you like a woman, bro. 
It's million of women right now that's laying up with a raggedy nigga. Mm-hmm. They know he raggedy. Yeah. Mm-hmm. He been raggedy his whole fucking life. But somewhere in her raggedy ass brain, she think the nigga's going to change. It's the meat. Mm-hmm. He, he drilling her. He just he just needs somebody to believe in him. He he been a loser. He, he, he been a loser. He been a loser for thirty two years. Yeah, he's going to change. He's going to change. That I'm going to change. He giving her that that broke dick. Uh, that, yeah, that broke dick. What? That shit that is strong. That, yeah. That's all they got to give is the dick. He killing her. <laughs> what? He like she like damn. She like he gonna get right. He gonna get, he gonna get right. right. He gonna get, he fucking the spark plugs <laughs> off. <laughs> he playing little he playing little Raheem game all day eating the cereal up the juicy juices. He yeah. drunk. Three packs of yeah. juicy juice. He, what? mommy, mommy. He vacuum. Mr. Mr. Mike drunk my juice. Shut up, boy. Go in your room. Come on. He cleaning what? the house. That's your dad now. He cleaning the house. He clean, he clean the Man, house. He taking care of the he child. Hung, no, especially Going when the nigga, to get the groceries. But you know, you know a nigga that really be on it fucking for his life? The nigga that fucked the nigga package up and he hiding out? <laughs> oh, that nigga in the crib all day cleaning up for no reason. Anything smell good. He doing laundry. He listen. He doing school work with the boy. He cause he ain't going nowhere. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah that yeah, nigga yeah. like I'm staying in the crib the whole winter. I fucked that nigga package up. They gonna shoot that nigga club. socks off yeah. when they catch you. He yeah. hide, he hiding from the niggas across the tracks and yeah. all that shit. That nigga right there. Yeah. Yeah. He fucked it up with a Balenciaga. They he gonna he, shoot him out the Balenciaga. All he do, they catch listen, you. all he do is got his little clothes that he bought when he fucked them dudes package yeah, up. Yeah, facts. You know what I mean? So yeah. he take them little clothes, got them in the closet. Yeah. He, when they go on little dates, he. No, we gonna go out in the county, girl. Yeah, yep. let's go. Let's go to uh, Outback out in the yeah. county. Yeah. 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 Let's get a nice steak. That's yeah. a nice joint. Yeah. White people be at. Yeah, yep. and she about to figure out why you taking me out here. Uh-huh. Yeah, because yeah. he, he about to get shout out to Balenciagas. <laughs> she she running around telling him, he a good dad. <laughs> he he he'll be he catch the kid at the bus when she you know she she a registered nurse. Hey. Yeah. So as hey, soon as them <laughs> niggas get locked up, he out of that bitch. All right, I'm done. Bitch, I'm done. <laughs> Summertime come. And he, so, oh, yeah. No, 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 no. He hiding. Once you hide, you hide. Because <laughs> yeah. let me tell you something about hiding, right? The only time a nigga go into hiding is when he dealing with some niggas that he know. They ain't playing no yeah, fucking game. They ain't shoot you until you catch you on fire. Yeah, you know what right. I mean? That's the only time a nigga going to hide. <laughs> yeah, that's that's These niggas ain't There's play. a difference yeah. between hiding and ducking. Yeah. You know, niggas slip through here. He only spent... Four and a half minutes at each spot he stopped. He's ducking. Yeah. When the last time a nigga chased you, man, and pulled some heat out on your head, made you run a couple blocks high school? Probably. What happened? <laughs> what happened? Yeah, ain't nobody did that. Uh, <laughs> I ain't talking about on the football field. I'm talking about that. <laughs> <in real life. laughs> nah. You know, everybody got chased before, man. Yeah. We all been through that shit. Uh, <laughs> nigga chased you, threatened your life, man. Nah, you nigga, yeah, nigga chased me by his sister, though. What happened? Yeah, about his sister. <laughs> he always had problems with shit. Nah, real shit. Yeah, well, I, I was so when you, to, when you told his sister you was stalking his sister or something, you know you nah, he didn't want stalking. me having sex with his sister. Why? Well, of course he didn't. Like, yeah, that was yeah, your yeah. Was that my homie? Nah, he yeah. wasn't even my homie like that, for real. <laughs> uh, <laughs> and I, it, it was, I was like the type of thing. I, you know, I was like, I was like that nigga, like, you know, people like, you know what I'm saying? And he was one of them guys that, uh, his nigga think he, you know, this, that. But yeah, I was talking to his sister, and it was one time, it was probably like, I was heading home. It was me and my cousin. And um, we was walking home and shit. And this nigga was in the truck. Some niggas in the truck and shit. We seen the nigga. It was like a red truck. I was like, man, you know how back in the day when you niggas cut the lights off, you think it's the drive-by. And I was like, man, I don't know who the fuck this red truck is. And the nigga get out the car. He's like, yeah, nigga, I told you quit fucking with my, you know, fuck with my sister. And nigga, I took off. He got in the truck. <laughs> <laughs> Did he have a gun? Did you see a gun? I ain't see no gun, but Why you, you never, take off? nigga, nigga screaming. You don't know what the nigga got. Shit. <laughs> yeah, I, but yeah, his sister. Did took, you jump any gates? Uh, nah, I ain't jump no gate. I, uh, I took off through the woods. How many? And I sat in the woods for about like about thirty minutes. <laughs> Cause I, ain't, you know, I ain't know. I ain't know. I ain't know. I'm, I ain't know. I'm like, yeah, I gotta quit fuck with this nigga's sister. <laughs> Cause this nigga's sister gonna get me, oh, and he gonna get me too. Talked. Was the pussy worth? Was the pussy worth? Oh, pussy was good. <laughs> was it worth going back? Did you go back again? <laughs> nah, I ain't go back. I ain't go back. <laughs> they end up moving too. They they moved probably like maybe like two months. They <laughs> you never talk to her again. You, would you try? <laughs> to nah, I ain't fuck with her no took more. It one time yeah, I said I'm good. <laughs> I said yeah, you can have your sister back. <laughs> yeah, I'm straight. <laughs> Even though the nigga have a gun or die, he yeah. break it. I'm good. Yeah, I'm straight. <laughs> And nigga said, yeah, nigga, you quit fucking with my sister. Hey, look, hey, let me tell you, you something. Me. Let me tell you something, bro. <laughs> oh, Sometimes God. you got to get the fuck out of there. So you got to know when to hold him, know when to fuck When I ran, though, when I ran, I, I knew a nigga had that pistol. The nigga cut the lights <laughs> off, though. I ain't got no like, nigga He cut the lights pistol. off like he saw us. 
You remember like on Friday? Yeah. When the niggas, he drive. The nigga was driving <laughs> slow. Right off. <laughs> and that nigga smoked. He was like, drive by. And he then, the same, yo, and then he wasn't even no drive by yet. It was just a nigga that was just going oh, through oh, the Oh, when he hit the lights on you. I said, it's <laughs> over. I said, I'm gone. I, I, ain't, I don't know who, what's going on. I mean, listen, listen. Hey, I'm out listen, of here. See, you, see, you're not smart as me. <laughs> yeah, I'm gone. Because as soon as I heard the click of the lights, I would have been going. He wouldn't have had to get out. No, when we saw the lights, we did this. He was like, like, oh shit, cuz drive by. The nigga got out of the car. You and he was like, nah, nigga, yeah, you fuck with my sister with a whoop. Nigga, I took off running. He got in the, He got he in the truck and Did started you... cut through the woods. My cousin cut through the woods. And we just sitting there looking. And we like, bro, what the fuck going on? Like, I'm asking hey. my cousin, I'm like, yo, cuz, you, you got anything That's why that going nigga on? run route so good on the football field. <laughs> that nigga was a hell of a football player. Oh, I was, yeah. I was oh, yeah. ducking trucks and shit. Oh my god, man! Yeah, that's crazy. That shit man. was crazy. Hey, that don't shit worry about it. He had his out. He had his situations, boy. I ran a lot of times, man. I, that shit was like every week. It was like <laughs> I was on the street track team. Like I was running for United Streets of America University. Every time a car pull up and some dumb shit happen, I'm out. I ain't waiting. All that getting, all that being a, a, a boss stand. No, <laughs> no, I'm not doing it. And, and running for stuff that ain't for me too. All the like. nigga had to do is, nigga ain't even got to say nothing. All the motherfucker got to do is drive by in a tinted up car and, and too slow, I'm out. Nah, fact. Break it. It's yeah. always, I make sure I walk where alleyways is at. So yeah. I can always got to, yeah. get right the fuck out the way. Yeah. <laughs> nigga ain't getting, ooh. Uh, hell, you don't know, man. Yo, I don't give a fuck. Fuck that gangster shit. Yeah, some of the greatest things to do. I don't do. give a fuck. I'm going to run. Like if shit get really, <laughs> think sometimes I'm gone. it's best to go to big, big, you know, the big avenues, big places with lights at, where the people, that, that calm a nigga down sometimes. Oh, yeah, for like, sure. Oh, oh, this nigga, you know, yeah. shit like that. Yeah. This episode of the Million Dollars Worth of Game is brought to you by Manscaped. One thing I like about Manscaped, and once again, go to manscaped.com, code game. You're getting 20% off and you're getting free shipping. Let's establish that again. Manscaped.com, uh, code game. You're getting 20% off and free shipping. One thing about Manscaped, it keep me clean down there. Keep me clean. I ain't got to worry about no nicks. I ain't got to worry about cutting myself and all this other stuff. I can use it in the shower. I can use it. I'm talking about, listen, man, the lawnmower is everything. But not just the lawnmower, they got other stuff going on, the body wash, they got all that type of stuff going on, deodorant, I'm talking about the, the, the lip balm, I'm talking about Manscaped's got all type of stuff going on, everything that a man need to, to be right. You want to be right when you're approaching that, you know, that nice lady friend or whatever you got going on, even for your wife, your fiance, you know, your child's mother, whatever you got going on, Manscaped is where you go to make sure your grooming is on the next level, you're smelling good, you're looking good, you're going to be able to perform good. That's what Manscape is about. So make sure you clean down there, cause that's that's what I love it the most for. Is then they hook me up with the deodorant. Then make sure my lips ain't all chapped. You some wash the body wash. Manscape.com. Use code Gain. You're getting twenty percent off, and you're getting free shipping. Manscape.com. Code Gain. Hell, man, this motherfucker was a track star too, though. Motherfucker pull that motherfucking that life changer out. It's over. The life yeah, snatcher. He did. They can pull that thing out. I, they could, the whole hood said I look like Rocket Ishmael. <laughs> that nigga like Rocket Ishmael, Maurice Claret, Emmett Smith, uh, Barry Sanders, uh, Herschel Walker, all them niggas, man. Percy <laughs> Harvey. All them niggas, man. <laughs> he going crazy. Yeah, he, yeah. Was, it, he was chasing. It was a club night. Nigga was chasing me down on motherfucking Broad Street. Started letting off a couple shots at me. Damn. I was looking like Rocket Ishmael, they said. The I, ain't, I, ain't, I ain't ever had a nigga shoot at me, though. Oh, yeah. He I tried told to, him to leave that nigga alone. He tried yeah. to ice me. <laughs> I ain't but, but I read better routes to you that day. <laughs> you know <what> I mean? <laughs> I, I was on a motherfucking straight go route. <laughs> My motherfucking 40 time was 3.9. Then he got up out of there. I would have broke every fucking record. You hear me? Yeah. Shit. Before the gun went off. Pew. Yeah. I ain't had to wait for the gun to go off for me to start running. You get out the car and start screaming is enough for me. Yeah. I, as as I don't you know what screaming. you got, man. See, man, a lot of times it depends on... It. See, one thing about me, I'm a router. Anywhere that I'm going and I know it's danger, I can smell danger, I already got my routes so always. I'm for like sure. a GPS before GPS. For sure. I can run down that alley. I can slide up under that car. I can jump over that fence. Mm -hmm. I'm always scanning the scene. So... Shit like that. It been plenty of times when motherfuckers jump out, he be there. Oh, I don't I ain't got nothing to do with this, man. <laughs> this ain't got nothing to do with me, man. He ain't like I'm out of my business. I, I ain't got nothing to do. I ain't retaliated. It, 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 listen, he he'd, he'd, he'd do some bitch ass shit like that, right? And then laid all be saying shit like, I told you don't be fucking with them niggas, cuz. Yeah, yeah. I told you that, like, 
I mean, so it's real. I yeah. thought with the driver go there, we together. You no, just, we not doing nothing. Fuck, why we gotta be we? He only want to shoot you. <laughs> why he gotta shoot me too? Fuck, why would I? I don't understand that. Like dudes, homies, and all that. Like, all these dudes, like, oh man, yeah. If he coming to shoot a nigga, you want to be fuck them niggas. No, he just shot him. He ain't shoot me. We ain't beefing. <laughs> we ain't beefing. He don't even know you. No, 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 no. It ain't that, but. We ain't got no problems, dog. Because I, you shot him. Yeah. You ain't shoot me, no. Yeah. Why would I be mad at him? You want me to be mad at him so he can know that I'm mad at him. He now goes, he know that I'm mad at him. He shoot me he when goes, he yeah. just shot you. It's over with. <laughs> Leave it alone. It's over with. But we, he ain't shoot me. We ain't beefing. No, nah, fact. Damn. Hell yeah. Bitch ass shit. I'm just being real. You want, man. you want to shoot back though? For why? He didn't shoot me. He shoot <laughs> I'm him. just saying he probably finna kill him. No, but he's he not going to try to stop it. He ain't, no, because it ain't gonna be that deep. He no. just want to shoot him to give me. See, sometimes a motherfucker pull out a gun and shoot a motherfucker just to get him, not you know, it's like notification on the phone, like, nigga, I ain't playing with you. <laughs> where, you where you gonna shoot him at, though? Probably put him a put some leg warmers on him, that's oh, it. okay. Let me, so my leg. whole thing is like, yeah. Now nah, you shoot, yeah, you Throw gotta shoot, shoot the, the nigga back, man, I, don't, no, I know can't. niggas got shot in the thigh and died. Fuck right, but you listen, but Put some leg warmers clock. on me. He gonna put him on one. All, 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 this is what I'm telling you. It's not <laughs> that deep. If a nigga shoots you, right? He said leg warming. No, if a motherfucker shoots you and don't kill you, it ain't worth beefing for because it's just a notification that stop playing with me, nigga. And then you can walk away. Don't go back with me. Because now, now nigga going to try to do something else. All right. People what don't fuck think you like about? that sometimes. Fuck you talk, okay, so, 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 so Kevin kick out. Yeah. <laughs> so <laughs> you were supposed to get over retaliation. No, let, let me explain to you what happened to Kevin. They call him, his name was Kevin, but they call him kick out because nigga threw some leg warmers on him and every time he walked, he kicked his leg out. <laughs> so, no, it ain't funny, but I'm just saying <laughs> Every time he walk, this shit kick out. Yo, what? Every time he walk. This shit uh, go out to the right, though. Yeah. So he walk and shit go out. Yeah, kick out. Oh, that's you know the hood, Kevin yeah, but, kick but, out. But that don't mean that the nigga that, nigga that done so, it. So he ain't supposed to want no kid back. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the fuck is you I, would, listen, I would advise him, like, don't yo, just leave that shit alone. Yeah. Because a motherfucker ain't trying to kill you. He yeah. just wanted to just let you know don't play with me. No, he yeah. killed your leg. I ain't going to play with you no more. Yeah, cool. yeah, yeah, yeah. He didn't kill you. He shot your leg dead. Yeah, yeah. Like, Sometimes you got to let it see another day. <laughs> <laughs> Go to the hospital, get your mind right. Yeah. I don't know why niggas yeah, we gonna get out. We gonna see this nigga. Like, why is we? He shot Boo Boo. He ain't shoot Mike Rob. These <laughs> niggas from the whole neighborhood talking about we, we gonna see this nigga. We riding. Why is y'all riding? Shit. He don't got no problems with y'all. <laughs> Some folks' mentality is just like that. He niggas just did what he had to do. He just, don't listen to him, man. <laughs> <laughs> No, I'm just putting it for facts. I out think there. if I get shot, I feel like my homeboys they they gonna shoot back. He keep talking about his homeboys. He ain't talking about him shooting. Me. I ain't. You I, took I'm a nigga. Shoot, Yo, he I'm already shoot. said he gonna put his bed on the job. Yeah, yeah sip, the man sip. was ready to go to jail. Uh, yeah, he's ready. He's ready to shoot the house up. <laughs> yeah, he, he, he can't wait. With his bed, he ain't, <laughs> yeah. now self defense yeah. though. I'm, I'm gonna shoot back though because if you shoot at me, self defense. I'm protecting myself. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, man. You know, I ain't no murderer though. No, you okay. can't. Okay. I mean, what, what if a nigga want to shoot a comedian for though? You want to shoot Cause me because I was no, joking no, on no, you. No. Niggas be mad. You be busting jokes. Don't bust no jokes <laughs> on no niggas in them crowds. Now man. I have I'm, nigga. I have. Did before. a nigga ever step to you about? Yeah, it? I had a nigga. I was in uh, uh, Memphis one time. Oh, they ain't playing on it. It was nigga with straight goals in his mouth, looking at me like, bro, don't don't say that to me, man. Like, what you say to him? I forgot. What, and his girl was with him. You know how you embarrass a nigga with his girl there and shit. Oh like my, you learned from that, didn't you? Yep. Sure did. I said, I ain't mess with no niggas with no gold teeth no more. Did he see you after the show? <laughs> huh? Did he see you after the show? <laughs> he said, uh, nah, I th he think he did. Well, he gave you the look like, nigga, don't play me. Yeah, certain people be like that. <laughs> hey, let me just say But it be, like, it be like, dang, bro, like it's a comedy show. Like, Why you come? But it's like, like, like me and my nigga Alton, like, <laughs> we always be dealing with this shit like every show. Like with niggas like that think they tough. And I be like, bro, I call niggas out like, bro, what's up, bro? Like, what you, why you so tough for? You hey, a comedy show, with, with man. your girl? With your girl? With your girl? Like nigga, relax, bro. Like nigga, laugh, nigga. Yeah, niggas be so tough. Like you know, they say she like. Yeah, mm -hmm. you playing with me? One thing we found out yeah. about this, you ain't got threatened him for him hit for him to get the show. <laughs> Come on, man. he said nigga. He said that nigga just looked at him. And said, yeah, he said, nigga. yeah, yeah, like he like, said, yeah, all goals, man. straight goals, nigga. <laughs> you knew that nigga was a player, man. You, that how nigga, many, his how eyes many was niggas, red. How many niggas do you think he shot? His eyes was red. How many niggas you think he shot? Shit, he probably 
Shit, a few probably. Yeah, he shot a nigga on the way there. Yeah, probably that nigga <laughs> eyes was red, bro, with gold teeth, man. That nigga is serious. That beat his calcium. He's serious, bro. Like, That's all real. You just like, all right, I'm gonna leave that this nigga, nigga alone because I'm like, bro. But one time, I'm gonna tell you about no, some hold shit. Hold on, fuck that. Hold on. He got red eyes. That just mean he needs some vitamin C, bro. Or he might, but he, he, he not in his right mind. Well, <laughs> well, well, you need to piss something you in your eye. You should have gave that nigga some orange juice. His shit would have cleaned. Well, <laughs> but then it's like when his yo his girl sitting there too, and she just like she ain't saying shit either because she know she know the nigga. She had a mouthful so of gold. She goals. probably like shit. Yeah, he's serious. You might want to stop. So I'm like shit. Fuck it. I ain't gonna say nothing else to him. And I left. I went to the left side. He was on the right side. I ain't go back over there to that side. None the whole show. That's and deep. Niggas like, go back to the right side. I'm gonna tell you no, I'm not about going listen, <laughs> It was a bull, right? Motherfucker, cool. Listen, you ain't even gonna believe this, right? Had a security boat, boy that do security, right? So me, I'm I'm always on point because I, I I did security too. I did security life. Yeah. So my martial art techniques always kick certain alarms that go on on my head. So I know up, she, man. He know Ain't I know martial arts. Everybody know I know shit. black belts. I so seen that. Yeah, I seen that video you did when you whipped like three niggas. Yeah. So you seen it? The UCF shit. I was like, yeah, he got he got that shit. So listen, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> niggas know. So listen. So no, people know about my shit out here in the country. They don't they don't fuck with me on that tip. But what happened is. This is boy do security. I don't know. I've been in jail. Yeah. So when this nigga slide up, I'm like, cause you know, like people that do regular civilian jobs, when they not at work, they look like street niggas now. Yeah. They didn't used to be like that back in the day. Yeah. Back in the day, you had some 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 regular shit on or whatever. You didn't, but now these dudes got the tattoos, they got the skinny clothes on, the whole yeah. twist, the drip. I'm like, so I tell cuz the tapping mill, man. Watch my man right there. It's ready to go down. Yeah. I'm ready to slide up out of here. Yeah. Because when I see shit ready going on, I'm going to leave. If, he don't, if you want to stay, yeah. go ahead. Yeah. I'm cool with that, but I'm leaving. Yeah. And, and it's sometimes it's good when he stay because the tension there, they like, all right, Wallow left. Whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm like, listen, I'm ready to leave. He's like, where the fuck you going? I said, listen, man, cuz I think we should leave up out of here. It's, look, it's getting crazy. Yeah. He like, who the fuck you talking about? I said, right there, look at him. He yeah. look like he's ready to shoot somebody, man. Yeah. Whole time, nigga, security type bull, right? Nah, Do security and shit. So, I leave, right? I leave. I see the boy coming out the, the fucking door. Like, wow, look, come in. I'm like, I'm thinking he coming to get me. But Gil was coming with him. To, to tell him, like, he, they laugh. I'm like, what the fuck is he? Gil, what the fuck are you laughing with that nigga for? Yeah. He's like, nigga, man, I do security, man. What yeah. you all scared for? Yeah. I said, man, listen, man, it's just my senses, man. I don't yeah. know what the fuck's going on. Yeah. I got to, I'll be, listen, I just, everybody look like a street nigga to yeah, me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Be scary. No. That's the bottom line about that whole story. I'm a bitch ass thick. I'm scary. I'm just, I'm looking at the police. <laughs> Watch that nigga kill. Him. Yeah. Right. Him? <laughs> like the dog, he protect all of everybody. Like, he don't want no trouble. Like, oh, you don't know, man. Yeah, I do know. Nigga had a lot of That's tattoos. That's why I brought him the fuck man. out there before oh, he yeah. got to the and car. He like he smoked weed on the side. So, you know what I mean? Niggas with tattoos and smoke weed. Yeah, yeah them niggas dangerous, man. Boy, get the fuck out of here, niggas with tattoos and smoke. No, it's different type of tattoos. I know tattoos. What, they, what is it, like devils? No, like demon tattoos oh, yeah. and shit like that. Yeah, he's a murderer. Yeah, I'm like, oh, damn. See, I didn't know what that was <laughs> for a while. <laughs> yeah, you leave him the fuck alone. That's he ain't what, got shit to lose. Hey. That's, what, that's what I was telling this dude, man. This episode of Million Dollars Worth of Game is brought to you by Boost Mobile. One thing that I love about Boost Mobile, not only do they power my stuff, but like, their support is unmatched. They supported us on Million Dollars Worth of Game live tour. That's what I love about Boost Mobile. They just, uh, they boost everything. So right now, I don't know what you need to do. What you need to do is switch to Boost and find what more power feels like. Boost Mobile give you more power to pay as you go, as you please. Think about that. You can pay as you go, as you please with Boost Mobile. They're going to take care of you. That's why you need to switch right now. I mean, listen, at the end of the day, Boost, boost Mobile is just like, ah, uh, ah. Uh, it gives you more power to keep what's yours, yours. You know what I mean? You want to be on another level to where as though you're able to do your thing. You don't have no interruptions. You don't have to worry about getting weak. You can stay strong because it's going to continue to boost your service and make sure you're right. Boost Mobile's give you more power to save for only 50, 50 bucks a month. You get unlimited data, talk, and text on America's largest and fastest 5G network. So what are you talking about? What you need to do is you need to tap into Boost Mobile. Stop playing. They supported us. Let them support you. Boost Mobile. So what else you got going on? What else you got coming up in the future? Uh, you know, I got some, uh, we're working on a lot of different things, man. Movies, short films, sketches, you know, of course, stand up, you know, uh, just elevating brand deals, you know, work with the NFL. I got a lot of stuff, you know what I'm saying? But this year is focused on, I'm just focusing on elevation, you know what I'm saying? Absolutely. Um, beyond the internet, 
You know, that's my tour call, you know, but everything is beyond the internet. Absolutely. You know like, I, I didn't did it, but it's time to go to a whole another level. I'm going right. to do it because my people love, they want me to do it. I'm not going to ever stop doing the social media, but I just want to show them a different a different level when it comes to it. You, know, you want to show them growth. Yeah. Did Hollywood call you yet? I mean, you know, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm a part of that, that, that Hollywood. You know what I'm saying? I, I got a Hollywood agency. You know what I'm saying? I'm, Let I'm me in ask that you a loop. question, right? I can't say too much, but I'm going to say it. Has it ever been a time where it's though? Have you ever got a visitor? A visitor? Like somebody come to your house? <laughs> How can I explain this? Uh, when you're getting to certain levels and you're going up, somebody come see you. And want to come talk to you? Somebody come and see you and to help you go to the next, next, <laughs> next level. A lot of people, a lot of people, a lot of people, you know how you see, you might see somebody that's not that talented or not that funny or whatever, and all of a sudden they be all the way up here and you trying yeah. to figure out how that happened. Did, now I'm going to rephrase this question. <laughs> Have anybody came to visit you? Ah, uh, nah. <laughs> Hell nah. Nah. I don't think they going to try to do that. <laughs> I'm just saying. I want, nah, hell no. Nah. I hope, don't do it, man. <laughs> just say it, like, Please don't do that, man. I'm just asking, man. They do, I, might, I might say something. He's a fucking dickhead. No, you can't. They you can't say, yeah, they're going to try to you end your you're, you're done. Yo, he's a fucking dickhead, man. I'm just saying, up, listen, dog. I'm just saying, listen, 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 listen. Yeah, anybody ain't right, man. Question. Did anybody come see you? No comments. No, no that, comments. Nah, real, nah, real talk, bro. What? Somebody ever, like, Tried you on the same? What? Yes. No, ain't nobody tried me like that. Bro. No, no, nobody tried me. You, you did, like, did you ever, like, heard shit happen, like, in the middle of the night? No, 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 no. Yeah, Fuck seen that. shit. Bro, yeah. nobody never tried you? Who tried me, man? Come on, man. Like, come on, bro. Like, you nah. gonna sit here with that dumb shit? Ain't nobody never tried me in the The joint. old head, you was boxing. That's different, man. He was, you know, me, he was training. That ain't different. You going down the old head cell, he teach you how to box every day until them motherfuckers come get you out of there, man. Don't, don't be fucking trying that with my fucking nephew. You no, ain't even know what's going up. down. I ain't know what's going on. Yeah. Oh. He just ready to knock you out and knock you up. You was going to wake <laughs> up pregnant, nigga. No, that wasn't the case. In the joint. Fuck what know. you talking he about. He seemed like a oh, nice shit. person. I don't think he would have done that. I'm just saying, I know, I know how to view people. Listen, they had to come get him out of there because, you know, he ain't no. Old head teaching him how to box. They had to come get him. The other old heads who knew him from the hood found out he was in the old head cell learning how to box. Uh, and they had to come get him up out that joint. Like, you know. I, I think he was a good person. I don't think he would have done anything. <laughs> yeah. Have you ever heard him doing something? Or something? Yes. Yeah, I heard about it afterwards. There was oh. a lot of things that happened. Well, it was coming. Nah, I don't think it was going to happen. <laughs> you don't think so? No, because he seen me had a nice conversation. We was talking about life and all type of shit. Right. I don't, he Nigga licked like chocolate that. off his back. He still ain't doing it. What are you doing? No, this is, this is a technique. <laughs> <laughs> this is a boxing technique. <laughs> Yo, this Hey, man. What technique is this? <laughs> yeah, it's crazy. Like, how was the first day, though? Your first day walking? Scary as a motherfucker. It, 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 was, it, was, real, you, it, it was real scary. My first day was real scary. It was scary. It was real scary. So it was like, it was real scary. So it was on the tip. Like, uh, I didn't know what was going to happen. You know, I was a, I was a dude from the streets, but I always had lodge and I realized I'm in a, I'm in a, un, in a, in a foreign land. Yeah. And, uh, you know, you never know, you know, you got to know when to hold them, know when to fold them, know when to walk away, know when to run. So now that I'm in this, this dark situation, uh, it was just all type of shit was going through my mind. But I know that when I walked in, I walked in with my innocence, and when I left, I was going to take my innocence with me. Mm. That was the whole thing. It was about a journey. Mm. <laughs> That's a long fucking journey. It's a, yeah, the journey, man. <laughs> he walked in with his innocence. He didn't leave out so innocent. Go <laughs> oh, listen to this, man. He's lying on me. He's putting smut on my name. I don't know why he didn't he leave out his innocence as you walked in. I don't know why he tried to attempt to assassinate my character. <laughs> he tried. He would. He, he tried to say that shit on some old ass James Bond shit. All I knew is. <laughs> I walked in with my innocence, and when I left out of there, I was still innocent. Like, no, nigga, you was guilty. That's why you <coughs> walked the fuck in there from the gate. Yeah. All right. So you walked in guilty. Fuck is you talk about your, your innocence. Yeah, man. Yeah, that's crazy. But um, we appreciate you, man, for oh, pulling man. up, man. Yes, we do, bro. man. Love, man. Funny as a motherfucker, yeah, man. I appreciate it, bro. You one of the motherfuckers that you know come up off the social media and that we respect yeah. and that we watch and we see you know Wallow always send me your videos because that yeah. nigga be up at 
four in the fucking morning. So he and follow me back, Wallow. Oh, I ain't cut, following you? Nah, you ain't following me. I'm I following saw me. that shit the other day. I'm like, man, nigga, get the follow. How you ain't following the nigga? You send me all those videos. I don't know how. You know my <laughs> shit be fucked up, man. I yeah that yeah. I don't follow him. He lying. He just did that. Oh, he lying. I ain't touch nothing. No, he didn't just do that. Oh, you fool. He ain't just I do ain't that. You must. Hold on. If that shit be fucking up. I don't know what it you must, It must do, bro. Instagram be having me following people I ain't following. Let me see. I looked on it the other day. Look, he lying. He I started to call you. I was like, nah. Bro, that shit just happened, bro. He lying. He don't see no just happened. Nah, he did hell. He no. So listen. But listen. <laughs> this old thing. What advice do you have? Because, you know, what advice do you have to give to that person that got, that's funny, uh, that got the 10,000 followers, people is engaged in their stuff, what advice you had to give them? Because it could be discouraging because, you know, everybody critical, everybody, you know, trying to compare people. What advice do you got to give to that young person, that young man, young a young girl doing their thing on social? I would say, man, you got to be different. You got to do something totally different from what people are already doing. You got to stay consistent. You know what I'm saying? You got to find your why, like why you doing it. You know what I'm saying? Because that why is, is what's going to really keep you going. You know what I'm saying? So if you ain't got that why, it ain't going to make sense. You ain't going to be able to go 10 years. You ain't going to be able to go 20 years. You know what I'm saying? It's going to be just a certain time because your why is just for that moment. It's for a, a piece of fame or a for to get you some money. You know what I'm saying? Like my why is, you know, I want to be longevity, man. I want to be a legend in this. You know what I'm saying? I'm a part of the new generation when it comes to this comedy act. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And I, Like I said, I don't just look at other people and, and, and try to feed off them or, you know what I'm saying, try to be, do what they do. I do what I do. I do what, you know, what I'm a part of. I do stuff from where I come from, you know what I'm saying. I do my real life, you know what I'm saying. So everything you see, every video, you you know, I do, man, either I done seen it or I done been through it, you know what I'm saying. And yeah, my so, why is because I wanted to educate the youth. No, nah, facts. And I wanted to give out some relationship advice. Yeah. Which I call game, yeah. you know what I'm saying, to my followers because I've been through a lot, you know what I'm saying? I've seen it all, I've done it all. Yeah. I've been, you know, I got locked up, I've been to college, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I've, I've been all across the world. Inspiration is the you, big You know thing. what I'm saying? Yeah. So for me, I was just, that was my why. Yeah. Because that's a big thing you said. You got to figure out your why. What, yeah. The reason why you're doing what you're doing. Are yeah. you just doing it to have fun? Yeah. Are you doing it with a purpose? Are yeah. you doing it with a goal that you're trying to reach? Why are you doing it? Or are you just see, doing it for some fucking likes? Yeah. yeah, that's deep because like once I realized, see, my why is to reach to the why of the black belts in martial arts. To be to to be there. Yeah, you know I mean to live to live off the earth, be able to go in the woods, be one with the world, sleep in the woods, no sleeping bag, this deep shit, you know? Yeah. Just to be ultra deep to the highest level. Cause why is like when you reach the next level. I'm gonna just say this right. To anybody that ever said, I just want to be one with the earth. You know, I just, you know, I'm just, y'all full of shit. What the fuck does that mean? I'm just trying to be in tune with the sun. I'm just trying to, be, what the fuck are you talking about? So you're shallow and not deep. No, I'm so not, you know, you're right. <laughs> because I never, you're, because you're, you're shallow. That, that, that'd be the problem with a lot of motherfuckers, that everything's you're too not deep. deep. They always on some deep, dark, dumb shit. You're not deep. You feel what I'm saying? No, I'm not deep because life ain't you, deep. You don't know what life is really about. Then. No, okay. What is life really about? It's about being deep and being one with the earth and being a traveler. I'm just a traveler. I don't live here. Yeah. What the fuck does that mean? You you right next to me. Hold on. Yes. Yeah, I just punched you. But I said oh, I'm traveling you're through. You're right fucking here. I don't live here. Where, where you traveling to? I'm not from here. Hold on. Wait. Oh, you're still here. Let me see you travel some fucking way. I'm going to be traveling once we've done with this. The fuck are you talking about? I'm, I travel. That's some deep, dark, dumb shit. And anybody who says that shit, I just want you to know you're full of shit. Yeah, you just don't understand life yet. You ever said that? Some deep shit? No, I'm, I'm just, I just want to be one with the earth. Yeah. I, I, I've never seen it. I, 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 it may be like a part of his purpose, man. You know, spiritual level. Say I what guess. you want to say. What is one with the earth? Explain that to one me. One with the earth? Guess your it's too deep for him. Your to know. No, your connection. You like, and him is shallow. No, 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 no. Y'all don't understand wait. deepness. Well, I, well explain I it. Deep. I'm asking you. I need you know, some knowledge. Explain it. No, I'm not explaining it because I can't. It's sacred. What the fuck? I get it. I get it. But I understand. I understand what he what he's, what he's trying to say. But what? Some people may not understand because they not on that. That's see, he was on. He's understand. Level. He's deep. 
You know what I'm saying? Um, You're deep. Now. Listen, if I don't understand how to how to plug the fucking cable up because I never did it, you can a motherfucker can explain. No, this is a, this is what I mean. This is how we go. Explain to me what one with the fucking earth means. It's to be air. Connection. Connection to what? The universe. The next level. <laughs> His purpose. What the fuck does that mean? Touching souls, changing lives. That has nothing to do with being one with the earth. Inspiring. Water is one with the earth. Trees. Sun. The moon. The stars. I hate both of you black Oxygen. motherfuckers. The I grass. hate both of you motherfuckers, man. The concrete. I just want bricks. to tell y'all that. I hate both of you motherfuckers. The apples on the tree. You light-skinned ass nigga and you charcoal-ass nigga. I hate both of you niggas. <laughs> Okay. What movie that was from? I hate whipping Goldberg slips because they black, nigga. Oh, that I was, hate the back of far with it. That was, uh, it was, boys, it, was it boys? That was, that, was, uh, that was Bernie Mac, though. Y'all don't need those. It was Bernie Mac huh? that said, Don't be a menace. Don't be a menace. Yeah. That's what it is. Yeah. Yeah, I said menace yeah. aside. That's he ain't watching no movies in jail. Yeah. Only, only pornos. No, no. Now, that, no. One, that one ain't Bernie Mac. That was the nigga that looked like Bernie Mac. Yeah. Dark skin nigga. Was it? That was Bernie. That Mac, was Bernie. Man. Mac? That yeah, was Bernie. Man. Mac. That was Bernie. Yeah. 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 Rest okay. in peace to Bernie, man. Yeah. You already said Eddie was your favorite. Yeah, Eddie is my favorite. Yeah, that's what's, my your, what's your favorite? Before you get out of there, what's your favorite moment from Eddie? Another Professor. That's my favorite movie. I love the way he played those characters at that dinner table, and that's one of the biggest reasons why I do my character work. And I did my Banks Family Christmas. I kind of did something like that, you know, with my character. But I, I, I do that to let people know, like I can really why do this do on the, on a Tyler Perry level. Hold up, what's going on over here? Out of all of that shit Eddie Murphy did, you said the fucking Lenny Professor. No, he's a, yeah, that's work. That's, no, that's, that's, that's like nigga. It. it coming to America, he was everybody in the barber shop. No, he was. No, no, I said character work. But he was the white man, but he whipped Joe Lewis. But you saw another professor before you saw. Uh, no, you didn't. Come, come to America, America first, nigga. You young, nigga. You gotta oh be young. Oh my god, Say some shit. Like, you know what you You young ass. <laughs> You disrespecting Eddie, man. You apologize, Eddie. I ain't got to apologize. I ain't got to apologize. apologize. Nigga, apologize no, I'm not apologizing. Fuck you, me. No. Nutty Professor came yeah. up with fuck coming to America. That's the movie I grew up on. Let it yeah. go. Oh, but right. I knew well, coming to America as well. You better go watch that motherfucker yeah. six times when you get out of there. I done watched this shit a thousand times. I seen Traded Places. I seen Traded Places. That was shot in Philly. Yeah. I seen damn near all Eddie Murphy shit. Oh, I like Martin. I like Jamie Foxx. I like. Mike Epps, I like all the OGs. Who your top five comedians right now? Right now. Richard Pryor. A. No, 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 no. no, 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 no. no motherfucking the Richard Pryor. The motherfucker's out now. The young yeah, motherfucker's oh, out oh, now. I was going to say, yeah. oh, oh, right now? Social media. Social media? They ain't got to be a social media. It's right now. Right. Right. right now. Right now. Shit. 85 South. Yes. Uh, shout out to them. Shout out to 85. I like Mike Epps. Kevin Hart. Yes. Phil. Um, Mm, two more. Mm. That inspires me. I ain't say nothing about inspiring you, nigga. I mean, nah, they got to inspire me. That's nah, the only I reason why I fuck with who you like. Um, <laughs> Don't worry. Alton Walker. Okay. Um, and you have one more. Ooh, this is where it gets juicy. Uh, you gonna leave one of your homies out? He's gonna leave one of his homies out. Um, hey, Dizzy, I seen that motherfucking interview when you didn't mention me, nigga. Can I say two? Fuck no. God damn. Uh, Shula King, Country Wayne. Who? Okay. Country Wayne. No, he said. No, he tried to say two niggas. <laughs> we just saying Country Wayne. That's it. You try to say two. We only. Ryan Davis. Snap Green. Tyler Chronicles. Uh, he's snapping out. He's yeah, snapping. All, right. all my niggas, man. Before, all the niggas hard. And listen, we're going to end the show yeah. like this, right? Before we get off here, man, we want to give you your flowers, brother. Young brother. You the shit, young brother. Keep, keep doing, doing your, your thing, shit. man. Keep doing your thing. Don't stop. Keep kicking their ass. Yes, sir. You know, and until the next time, because we know by the next time we see you probably be at 13, 14, 15, 20, 40, 60 million followers. Yes, sir. Because you don't Big plan on coming. stopping. You Big know what movies. I mean? But we're going to end it off like this. We had somebody up on here. We asked them, they top five comedians. One of the first motherfuckers they shouted out was Desi Bank. Didn't return the favor. Who was it? Who was it? <laughs> Shit, where you at? We'll run the clip back when, uh, you know. 
He came here? Jess hilarious. Oh, really? Yes. I like Jess. Yes. She's a top two. Jess, B. Simone. Legend. Pretty V. But no, Jess, Jess. You ain't even say tell. Pretty V and she been your shit. I know she gonna be like, motherfucker, you ain't shit. Nah, she, gonna, she ain't gonna say that. She gonna but say I start saying names. After no, the nigga, fact. no, no, no. You said pretty nigga. That nigga ain't shit. See, pretty see, be kick that nigga out. Right? Yep. Yep. He ain't shit. Yep. No, don't do that. Yep. No, you don't do that. Hey, she you walk ain't around. Said, she walk around name. with you, nigga, pregnant like this. Man, when you, you even say when you were saying comedians, no, get off. Why you want to exclude her? I'm talking about. You I'm talking about stand up comedians. You ain't shaking up, man. Oh, don't exclude her. She gonna be doing stand up. No, she is. I'm just saying at that moment. I'm thinking about those guys. That shit. But these niggas ain't shit. She ain't shit. Pretty big. I love shit. Man, fuck these niggas. I don't see. See, cause he fucked up. But nah, she know I love her, man. I love everybody I work with. Typical nigga shit. Fuck nigga them shit. niggas. They, he fuck up. Fuck you niggas. Fuck Damn. you niggas. She probably ain't even gonna watch this. Yes, what? <laughs> I'm DMing her this shit. <laughs> what the fuck is he talking about? We gonna he make gonna sure she's gonna be. He gonna clip. <laughs> nah, don't do that. Don't do that. Man, pretty V, <laughs> you're amazing. That. You see, this is it. You're great. You're a star. FaceTime her right now. Ah, no, you got FaceTime right her. FaceTime mm -hmm. pretty even. She ain't me. even gonna answer the phone. No, yes, she is. Yeah, FaceTime. She don't fuck with him like that. It ain't skit day, nigga. It's... FaceTime. We finna see. If she answered, that means she fuck with me, right? Yeah. Right, she turn. said it ain't skit day, nigga. No, FaceTime. I'm finna see. I'm FaceTiming. Fuck. She said it ain't skit day, nigga. Watch this. She Look at the bike. You trying to I'm fix snitching. your clothes and shit. Oh, you know, you got... ah, ah, this nigga got She don't even ask me that. I told you. He called the fake number. He called the fake number. He called the fake number. I called a real number. If she answered this, I'm telling her, I'm snitching. Oh, you fucking it ain't. Yeah, so what? Hey, uh, hey, Oh, she answered. She hey, answered look. the phone. She answered. Pull over, V. She hey, v. answered. Hey, V. V, look, I told these folks. No, no, no. no, 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 no. I'm explaining no, like a man. No, no, I'm no. explaining like a man. Put, the, put, so put, put, put it up to the microphone so we can hear on the so microphone. Look, v, they asked me, right? Turn the camera. Can you hear me? So they asked me. They was like, who is your top? Um, five. five comedians on social media. And I said, uh You didn't say her! You didn't say her, nigga. V, relax, man. So I and I, let me say it, nigga. Stop bitching. Now you bitch. I'm a motherfucking man. I said your name. Like, I know you did, you lying ass I nigga. Jazz, you ain't say her name. So V. You ain't Look, V, look, calm down. First of all, he, I said your name, but I was like, can I have you said more than name? five? I said, can I have more than oh, five? Oh, you lying. You lying. Nigga, we're going to play the clip back. You, I said, you, said, you said her like she was like number 15. No, the fuck she yeah, was. She yes, was, she you, was. You named anybody. And we had to say V. Nigga, I said V before. He, he, no, you I didn't. said V name, and they were like, damn, you didn't say V name in no, the first five? No, no, no we yeah. didn't. You lying. That, look, I wouldn't even, in my mind, I wouldn't even thinking about social, because I don't even really watch a lot of people on social media. Look how he explained it. I said, 85. Hold on, wait, I'm finna tell him who I said. Put her to the mic. Tell him the 15 that you said before. Put, put her to the mic, bro, so said, we can hear her. I said the 85 South Show, of course, which is, that's three people, really. No, that's one. No, no, no. Nigga, that's, that's, that's three one. people. That's Carlos, you that as you that as one. and that's Chico. One, nigga. That's three people. We counted that and as one. And I said, uh, after that, I Mike said, Epps. I said Mike Epps. And, I'm thinking, and I'm thinking about stand-up. That's what I'm thinking. No, I said you Kevin said Hart. Kevin Hart. I said, uh, who I said? Country I said, Wayne. I said Alton Walker. Walker. Country Wayne, somebody else. I said um, Country Wayne, Shula King. Then I said Pretty V. No, you, no, you didn't. Did. No, you didn't. No, you, you didn't. You lying. Y'all niggas crazy, man. No, you didn't. Niggas, yeah. he ain't say, that nigga ain't shit. Cut that nigga off, man. Man, I just I just sent her a message the other day telling her how much I love her. And you ain't saying my name right now on that interview? Now y'all finna fuck See? something up. See, that nigga ain't shit. That nigga ain't shit. He ain't shit, V. So you ain't we held you down. Wallow, we held you down. Wallow ain't shit. Let me tell you well, what this no, nigga said did, about you. He's he like, lied. He lied, V. I ain't say nothing bad about her. <laughs> he said, I snitched on you first. Man, don't be snitching on me, man. I didn't know you was no, a I didn't know you No, I got down first, so it's cool. <laughs> <laughs> no, that, that's what they do. They get down first. My fault. I ain't hope nobody hear this. Edit it out. Say something to the people. Okay, we don't shit. cuss me out on the camera. Cuss that nigga oh, out. Cuss fuck out. that nigga. Yo, yo, voice is on the mic. Go ahead. I know you want to do it. Well, you already know your dumb, dirty, black ass mm. forgot about me on your list, but you got 85 South out there. Mm. Yeah, I, I was that just talking about stand up. You mm. said what? Yo, you can keep going. You is very much so show off scene. And one thing about it, two things for sure. Wallow. Yes. Wallow, whatever it is, y'all better definitely know I'm 
Then Jesse top five. I'm actually everybody. See, you really favorite. different. You really like you really. No, you the fucking liar. Let, 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 let me do up. me. Let me do me, bro. Like you really like different. Like you really like special. Like I don't even put you in that category. You feel me? Like you, you don't like you really on a whole another level before anybody. Like fuck a category. Like you is the category. You feel me? Like these nigga tripping. You feel me? Like fuck these nigga. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love you, girl. Stop playing. I love you. I'm finna cash out you. What y'all do? <laughs> <laughs> you so ugly. <laughs> hey, V, when, when you coming? You, when you coming home? I'll be back Monday. Tomorrow. When you coming to the show? When y'all invite me. I already DM'd you. Make me, all right, make me I kick you in the center, yeah. Literally, you DM me, but you wanted to do the show too, but I really would love to come out there. Where y'all located at? Be in Philly Philly's? right now. Philly, Philly, young boy, young joke. Yeah, yeah, you, yeah, 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 you know how we yo, talk. Yo, what's the what's what's crazy part of Atlanta? The craziest? Yeah. The craziest part? Like, yeah. what you like, mean? What's like? wild on that? There's a few spots. I'm from Atlanta, though. We be down Atlanta, too, because, you know, I'm originally from down there. I mean, there's a few spots. So I gotta, I just want to know when I tell people that I can throw a it's spot. Like you ball headed now. You ball headed. I, I thought she been ball headed. You cut it? Oh, man, I'm me. I oh my fault. Not my fault, man. Say something to the camera. Man, hold it to the mic so they can see and turn nah, around. Nigga, man. I want to see her face. But you got you still can turn around. V, like v, v, you ain't got your hair done. What is it? What is it? Y'all already know what time it is. It's your girl Pretty V. I'm checking in. <laughs> <She's> crazy. <laughs> she, will she get high? She get high on the low. I don't think you don't smoke, do you, V? I ain't talking about that. I'm talking. Oh no, nah, I know she don't do that. Oh my fault, man. Yeah. You ain't finna do my lady. No, they were saying you was on that. You're not about to do my lady like that, bro. Now you try to hold it up. Now you try to hold it up. You try to hold it up. This is a piece of shit. You try to hold it down there and try to clean that shit up. I can't wait to see see that clip. Yeah, send me that cash out, man. I'm sick of this shit. Cash out. No, yeah. I ain't say that. Yeah, I ain't nah, say no I'm shit like that. Because this nigga snitch. Yeah, that nigga said cocaine. I said he do. I nigga, said he, he do. V. He did his nose like I this. I said he do. V. He did his nose like this. Hey V, I said he do. He Not know you. I, he know I don't do. No, that they too. said they. They said you was down there, the man, falling out. <laughs> yeah, they said you was in the snow. Cool. They said Dad, you wake you. You was in it. I know they lie. They said they call him Copper Nose. Nah, I know they lie. Copper Nose. They, they said Copper Nose. Them niggas lying. They said it was powder all over your face. Them niggas powder on my face. Powder, powder on my nah, face. That was donut powder. If it was, <laughs> nah, I was eating donuts. Nigga. <laughs> hey, but listen, man, he got a show to go do. We appreciate you for coming through. Hey, Pretty V, you pulled the bone. Pretty V with you, you man. Open right. up for you, man. Dang. Nah. I be yeah, shit, we gonna do some stuff, I ain't right. Y'all need to go on tour together. Really? She gonna be the host. And oh. it's just like that. Right.